Hey guys, it's me Diana. Welcome to my channel Sophisticated Divas and as you guys know I have been putting up many videos and this is going to be my last one for today. I am going to be doing my two month post-op tummy tuck. I had my tummy tuck done on March the 27th with Dr. Morgan Davuti and um, I'm extremely happy with my results and my training. I've been doing a whole lot today, washing, cooking, and um you know just getting my stuff together for the week and i'm actually starting to swell a whole lot more and i can feel it it's like tight i'm starting to get tight so anyway i'm going to do my two months uh post-op uh tummy tuck video with you guys showing you guys where i am i actually showing you guys uh my scar later on uh this week i'm going to show you guys what i've been doing as far as in um my scar treatment and what i'm doing as in to treat and fade uh my scar later on within the year i am actually going to have my scar tattooed like my um my boobs have been done but anyway oh yeah i want to tell you guys some guys asked me about this uh scar right here this scar right here was actually way up here this right here is when i had my gallbladder taken out in 90 or no was it 2004 or 2005 and so when he pulled it down he pulled it way down here this was actually my gallbladder scar it was like up in here and it got pulled down right there and then so tell you guys a little bit more this right here scar right here hold on let me zoom in a little bit more this scar right here is a scar from my lap band and then I had one right up in here uh, from my lap band a couple of round there so but anyway we're gonna get on to this video now all right you guys can actually see right there you can see I'm swollen so oh. so you guys can see so anyway I am two months post-op. This is my belly, and you guys can see the swelling. Woo! I am. Let me let y'all get in on that. Look at that swelling. For some of you guys that was thinking I don't have stretch marks, you can actually see the stretch marks. I used some cream that I made to actually fade my stretch marks. And, uh, okay, that's enough of that. Let's get on to this video. Two months post op. Here is my scar. You guys see, and like how I be standing, it makes it seem like it's shaded and stuff. Like my scar is very dark, but it's not. Let me lean back so you guys can see. That is still bruising. Here's my scar way down up in here. You can see it. So if I spread that, you guys can actually see. This is actually my scar. It goes out a little bit right there. This is fading scar scar and then here so I'm cut from hip to hip you can actually see from my cream has been working so much you can actually see where I was stitched under the under the skin so and then this is my pleating area as I go down and work out my pleats will actually uh, pull out and straighten out and it's actually swollen a lot right there and pleating a whole lot because I stay kind of swollen right here I still am like numb around here in this area but I am swollen. I'm, you guys can see a whole lot. David even thought that I had on a binder today. He was like, "You got on your binder?" I was like, "No." You can see. You can see I'm swollen. He was like, "Yeah, I can see it." So anyway, uh, this is what I'm looking like um, right now. Uh, you guys can see my shape. Two months post-op tummy tuck, and the scar is actually hidden quite well in my panty line. And like I said, later on within the year or so, uh, maybe next year, I am going to be getting a um, getting that covered. I'll be getting that getting that scar covered uh, with the tattoo. So anyway, I'm pretty much still happy with everything, and you guys can see some of the. Whew, I just feel so damn tight damn it's like these pants them pulling in my ass so two months post-op tummy tuck scar dr morgan 
Robert Morgan DeVuti here out of Duluth, Georgia. You guys can see what I'm looking like. So I'm swollen a whole lot. Swollen a whole lot, but I'm happy. And for those of you just now joining my channel, if you can go back to later on today, you'll see why I have on a band-aid and I'm still packing my tummy and uh, doing training. It's a marble in there, so uh, you can go back and you can watch that video if you like. And so um, this is actually what I'm looking at and I am weighing in at 150 pounds. And some of you guys are wondering what this is behind me. See that? That's, I got workout equipment attached. Let me go up some. See that? These are bands and shit. And this right here goes down to the bottom for your ankles. I got my whole damn house is just a workout place. And I close this door and it pulls me. It's in the living room or whatever. So anyway, if you guys wonder what that is, I just don't ever take it down. You know, this my house. Uh yeah. I'm happy. Uh, for those of you guys who are out there thinking about a tummy tuck, do it. George, my brother, I'm telling you, you look awesome. You look amazing. But I support you 100 million percent. If this is something that you're looking into doing and getting a tummy tuck, I say you won't go wrong. I uh, waited. And some of you guys that's thinking just because your insurance has approved it and everything, please work out and try working on getting your body as close to where you want it to be before you jump out there and get a tummy tuck. Um, you can go back and see one of my old videos where I asked uh, Dr. Steinberg about me getting a uh, tummy tuck. And he said that he didn't want me to get a tummy tuck because if I went and I lost more weight, then I would just have uh, extra skin. And, you know, and I might, you know, would have to go back in there and get some stuff like tweaked and all that. So try to get as close to your goal as you can so that you will be able, if you lose more weight, that you will be able to tone and continue to looking good. So I wish you all the best on your journeys and whatever else that you guys uh, might be doing because now I've done my tummy tuck. I'm pretty much happy with that. As soon as I'm released, I'm going to be working on to uh, get back right with my arms and I'm actually going to be on a um, on a journey to actually uh, really really tone my legs and tone my body I'm actually gonna shred a little bit more and I'm gonna uh, tone so I'm glad that this part is over and getting my body a little bit closer and a step closer to what I want it to be but thank you guys so much for watching again my two-month post-op tummy tuck love you guys don't forget to Thumbs up, thumb, comment, and subscribe. And follow me on Instagram. I love you guys. Bye.